We as a club are quite a major entity now in Utochita. We've we sort of we have the senior sections, we've got a first and a second team. And then in the recent latter years we've now started this junior section. The site's been sort of earmarked in recent years for sports, educational and youth development. And a few years ago there was a, a housing sort of group that started where they wanted to get involved into housing. That was overthrown by the people of Utoxeter and we were promised that it wouldn't happen. Well obviously now recent events have shown that in Utoxeter's future forward planning that that's now earmarked as housing development for Brownfield site again. So obviously the people of Utoxeter are getting together and, are, and the idea is to overthrow that and get it kept for sports and development use. I feel the rugby club and indeed Oldfield as a, as a whole club is very important. I mean, we've got the old um, listed building that is our Oldfield site. The football is here and obviously rugby is here. It is the home of our sport. I would say if, you know, if that's what its purpose was as is, is sport and it's you know, going to be a community area for um, children and adults to enjoy alike, then I think that's, that's more beneficial to the area than a, a, than a housing um, plan. I know it's a massively important sport, it's hugely important to, to communities and to kids and um, so I think you know, if they put more resources into it then it's going to be a benefit their council or their area that they live in anyway. We've got involved with the Picknells Valley uh, opposition group where we're trying to, with through petitions, pressure the local council into overthrowing the housing and obviously Team Wild as our sponsor for the rugby club have got heavily involved with us and uh, sort of working hard to get the petitions signed. We've just, uh, we're just over 2,000 signatures now already. That's already been handed into the council uh, and we're just keeping on going. The more signatures, the better. It shows what we're trying to do. Hopefully with the support of the community and the club and, and, and the stuff they're doing here, and, um, I'm all for, for them developing it for sport, um, and particularly the rugby. Um, so you know, I wish them all the best in it and you know, I offer my support. I mean, we've got the petitions online if you go onto the Team Wild website. There's certainly, uh, we've got the petition up in the Oldfield Club. Uh, you'll often find the ladies down around the schools trying to grab parents. We've got, it's, it's down in a few of the shops in town. But if you go onto the website and look, and look up for the Picknells Valley Press Group, you'll find the petition there online. So if you can't find it on paper, please sign it electronically.